good afternoon everybody bow hunting it's right around the corner this weekend is opening day this saturday um so we're, today before we run out of time we're gonna try to get some practice in uh we just got every year uh i grow and get stronger so um we go and get our bows adjusted get the weight uh set higher and has to get the uh the draw length and everything uh reset and all that so we have to get used to all that and stuff so uh down in our backyard this is our backyard right here we got two at two acres not a ton of land but this is not where we hunt we hunt out west um towards the mississippi river um, in wisconsin so we just got a we have a deer back there and uh some targets and hay bales so yeah let's go get practicing so everybody right here this is our Whatever you want to call it, shooting range, I guess. Um, I'm gonna be shooting at 20 yards. We have a that way. We have somewhere over there is a 10, a 10 yard dash, and where um, my bow is set at um, back there at the 20 yard dash, and then further behind that is the 30 yard dash. So right here we just got a a deer, and then we just got hay bales and some targets. So we're gonna grab our right here and head over there start shooting what do you say so guys like i said we're at 20 yards right here um my bow right here takes a couple shots Dead shot right there. That one, my last one. So my first one went a little high. I'll show you guys when I go up there. The first one was just a little high. Um, probably hit right below the spine. Um, second two right, right behind the ribs. I'm gonna split the arrows so they're right next to each other. This last one I put right where I wanted it and it went right through the lungs. So. So this is where all of them went. So, so guys, back here we got my little brother George right here. Um, he coming back to shoot a little bit. He can't. So where we are, um, yet to uh, be able to pull back 30 pounds, be able to hunt. So he's not quite there yet. So maybe next. He's only at 20 pounds. Is as much as he could pull back. So. Next year, hopefully, he can get some. So he's just gonna shoot. Uh, after I shoot, I'm gonna get my arrows, and he'll shoot a little bit.
All right, guys. So it's a little more accurate at my shooting this uh, this time, except maybe the last one. So this is where the last one went right here, way down here. But um, I was a little more accurate. You can see I was a little more accurate this time. So guys, now we're gonna go watch Georgie over here. He's gonna shoot a couple. Told you we're gonna be looking for some arrows in the grass. Well, guys, George couldn't seem to hit it from from right there at the 20 yards, so gotta move up to the. Do you want me to show you back there with the sound of trigger? He says it's the trigger. He says it's the trigger that. This is my first time using the trigger. Yeah, so we have to move up. We're gonna move up to the 10 yard line right here. See if you can even hit from here. Top top pin. Top pin. Put the middle pin on the middle, on the ribs. Well, <laughs> let's go see this shot. Yeah, that's not good, because look what he did to this. Oh, well, I was at that stage once. We all have been there. Well, guys, I'm just back here trying to film. Oh, shoot. And the whole family comes back here. Let me do one more. So, she just, she just shot, um the roof of the the thing that the you hay bales are, are in terrible. so yeah i think she just broke it well guys now my dad's down here over there um so sophia kept shooting high um of the target and going past it so we got to get the wrenches and i'll reset her sights lower than they are because she just keeps hitting the top of the deer or way above it so yeah so if you, you guys don't know this is my sister right here Sophia, yeah. So guys, we got the Allen wrenches. Go fix her bow right now. Well, guys, um, so Sophia, up by the target, got a arrow stuck, stuck up in the wood. My dad's gotta go get his tool bag and get that, get that out with a wrench or a chisel or whatever. So, George is just up there right now shooting from 10 yards. Try the middle pin. That was which pin? Middle or top. Same spot? No. That one was way that was above the target. Middle pin right in the middle. Can you pull them? Oh your arrows are going to the right. Yeah, no. I just have to add that. Aim to the top pin right to the left of the... That's your top pin? Mm -hmm. Aim into the left? Where? Right about in the middle. Not in the middle. 
So those last two shots, Sophia was pretty consistent and accurate. These are her. This is a grou her grouping at 20 yards. Not bad. Um, I can almost fit. I can almost fit my whole hand around there. So, um, yeah, she's she gets a deer in front of her, and she shoots like that, she'll get a deer for sure. Guys, now we're at 30 yards right here. We will be moved back. Just me and my sister out here now. This is her first time uh, after shooting for 20 yards. Uh, first time shooting from 30 yards. She hasn't missed a whole target yet. So for up there, we have our. Uh, you guys seen it? It's, we have those two hay. We have two hay bales, and then we have two. Um, we have two. Uh, cardboard targets with you have two cardboard targets with uh, just sharpie um, circles on there and then we have a bullseye that one she missed right. now we gotta try to find this arrow that she shot you said last time Find it yet? Find it yet? We got it, guys. She can be back to forever looking. I'm gonna put it in her. Put it in her uh, holder over here. I don't know where she went. <laughs> No, not yet. Did you find it yet? She's still back there looking. <laughs> well, I think it made its way back to the holster up there. Safe and sound. Got it over there. One past it, it just dotted on back here. I'm just that good, I guess. I gotta do five more. You guys, uh, she's gonna shoot her last one right here, and I'm gonna shoot one more round and then probably call it a day. Guys, I'm shooting my last round at um at uh 30 yards here. Let's see what we can do. That's for all in the same spot right there. I can almost fit on my whole hand around there. So, I mean, the group is good. I was aiming for up here, um, but they would all just drop and right to the right. This is the one I only good shot. There's my shot. That went uh, past it. So, I think that is gonna be all we're gonna do today. Um, well, uh, we have a couple more days till, uh, opening day, so, uh, we'll practice a little bit, uh, throughout the week, and hopefully be ready and have a nice, solid, accurate shot by the end of the week. It's currently, uh, it's Monday right now, so we got a couple more days, so I'll practice, shoot a little throughout the week, and, uh, see you guys on Saturday. All right, guys. It is Friday now. You know what that means? Tomorrow is opening bow season, opening day. So we're gonna get on the road here, a couple minutes, stop the sleep farm for a couple things. I'll see you guys by the river. Oh guys, we're here. There's the house, we're up at the house now. Um, gonna get unpacked here. Uh, I don't know where my dad and 
brothers are. They probably want to get uh, something to eat at a restaurant. But we're going to get unpacked, and um, I don't know if they put all the cup holders and stuff on the stands yet or not. Um, so we're going to probably, or if they didn't do that yet, go do that. Uh, see you guys later. Good morning, everybody. It is now 4.30. Uh, it's like 60 degrees out right now. But we're going to, it's not too cold out, so we should be fine without long johns. Um, but uh, we're going to get dressed and um, get dressed, get stuff. All ready to go and I'll head down there. Nothing on the camera. Six. Nine. 
Um, like I said earlier, um, when we come up this evening, I'm gonna go up. There's a trail over there that I'm gonna go up. Um, we have a stand up there. That's where I'm gonna sit this evening. So right there, there's a trail. And the trail right there, where the tip of my bow is, that's where I'm gonna be going. And it goes all the way up that hill. All the way up there. Um, that's where I'm gonna go later this evening. And then where my sister was sitting today is where this evening is where is where um my grandpa's gonna go. And I think my sister might come up there on the hill with me. Um, so yeah. Here's how it's going. Like, are you? So guys, change of plans. We're not gonna go fishing this afternoon. Um, there is some branches and stuff we got trim trim up. Um, from our grandpa today. Um, in front of his stance, we can get some sh uh, shooting lanes, and then uh, some branches in front of my stand. Um, cut uh, take a pull saw and get some of those out of there. Um, so we're gonna go cut some out. So last year opening day actually we uh, Put a new stand up the hill stand. I'm gonna go to this afternoon. We put it up the same uh, opening day But we were using chainsaws and everything cutting trails and stuff And that an hour after that uh, is when I got I went went back out and actually got a deer uh, When we were all using chainsaws and stuff in the woods, so a deer came back up there so. On to the next one, guys. All right, guys, you're at the hill stand here now, where I'll be hunting this evening. There it is right there. Just over here, well, over here yesterday, and just, I just seen it, like, trampled with deer prints there's a run right here that goes goes right here right through there and it goes pretty much right underneath my stand so yeah we're gonna trim some branches up there now probably that one and um, a couple others guys here I go
What I like about this one, guys, is it's in a ravine. We're up on a hill. We're facing up the hill. So anything that's straight out for me is pretty much on ground level with them. So I'm going to trim some branches up right here. This one right here in front of me. I wasn't made to be a tree trimmer. Get that one. Me and my little brother Georgie here are gonna go check the camera up by the stand we're hunting tonight. I can always guarantee you there's gonna be at least a bunch of dough on there. Yeah. Nope. I don't know where the trail is though. There's a new trail cut down here. I gotta go find it. This hill, we sure I brought my four wheeler because it super guys, steep. See, see what we got. Four wheeler, four wheeler, four wheeler. Looks like two deer, two doe at least. Looks like a doe. Go there, go there, go there. And looks like he's trying to check out the camera. I think that's the same doe. All right, guys, we're just doing some work out here in the woods. Uh, it's not, it's like 12:30 now, so ah, uh, we're gonna be probably get out of here like 1, 1:30. 1 uh, let it sit for a couple hours, then come back out hunting like 5:30. So. Yeah. Alright guys, we're headed out now to the evening hunt. It's about uh, 4.15 here now. Uh, me and my sister Sophia are going to go uh, sit up there. We agreed that if it's a buck, I get to shoot. If it's a doe, she gets to shoot. Two bucks, we count to three, and on three we shoot. So, let's go get it.
My dad's heading back up to the house right now. He didn't see anything. So, and it was kind of a little disappointing opening day, but this is a opening day of many, so how many other days we'll be hunting. Oh, this is only one of them. All right, well guys, um, fun day. Didn't even know we didn't see anything, but still enjoyed it. Enjoyed it out here. Um, if you like this video, don't forget to ring the notification bell, smash that subscribe button, and come on, comment down below. And uh, just a little extra thing, hit that thumbs up button. Um, yeah. So. Thank you guys for taking along. I'll see you guys in the next one.